at 12 a.m. My fish tank cracked. Let's see where the cracks is. Water has leaked everywhere. My floor is soaked. What about my fish? I know. Paco owes me some money. Who knew a movie would come in handy? Thank you, Deuce Bigelow. What's up, y'all? I am back with my video of me building my four block cube. Now, if you've seen the beginning, you know my tank broke. Obviously, I did not know that I could not have my fish tank on that little bitty stand. So nobody told me. Whatever. First time fish hobbyist, you gotta learn as you go. So learned that it needs a very stable bottom piece, but hey, whatever. That's why you see me over here putting this little wooden stand together because the stand that I have was not suitable for the fish tank. And I have a 10 gallon fish tank and it's not even no big fish tank like that. But however, your sides need to be protected at all times. That means your tank needs to be set on a flat surface. Anywho, so me jumping into this video of me actually building this cube. Let me tell y'all, this gave me some problems. Now, I initially put it together. I thought I was tripping when I first initially put it together because the screws and the four areas when you put the cube together on the sides, it was not going in the last cube. It just would not line up with the hole. So finally I took all these screws out and we did everything all over again and realized, okay, it is not me, it's not your girl, it is Walmart's product. So I went ahead and grabbed my, um, my, my gun as you can see my nail gun and made that whole work baby and we made sure that shit fits yes god so now you see me over here cleaning out my fish tank so everybody know when you get a new fish tank you are supposed to clean it inside and outside of the fish tank to make sure you have no debris that is left over from the store you know that's like dust or whatever get inside your fish tank filter it's just ugly okay so anyways um you see me putting back the rocks that i had in my old tank inside of the new tank why i need that bacteria um i kept my rocks inside of a plastic grocery store bag and hope that it would keep some of my beneficial bacteria on my rocks um i kept the rocks damped also but who's to say if it did if it didn't i don't know but um, I kept everything in water overnight in the fish tank water that exfoliated. I siphoned, siphoned everything out of the tank before it got to exploding. However, this is me right here putting this all in there right now. And the plant decor that you see that I'm putting inside of my tank right now, um, I have a mixture of classic plants and live plants. I really like the way the live plants really benefit the fish tank. So that's why I like them. My idea was to get as many live plants to replace the plastic plants, but as I got more live plants. I kind of like the way everything blended in together. And then also found out once you, you know you plant your plants inside of the gravel and they start growing because you know your water is good and your fish is thriving and everything's going, your plants start growing. And once your plants start growing, you can just break the end off and plant that other piece back inside the gravel and there you go. Now you got your own forest of plants inside of your fish tank i.e what you see me doing right now i have a forest of plants inside of my fish tank but it's beneficial for my fish and it's definitely helped them to breathe now you see me going in and adding my water putting my filter back pump back in and mind you guys i was just about to clean my tank I was just gonna clean my tank. I was just gonna take a little 10 to 15 percent of water out and clean out the filter and you know rinse everything out of my tank water to make sure I kept my beneficial bacteria but then that happened. So because that didn't happen, I mean because that did happen, 
I went ahead on and just kept my filter dirty. I kept everything dirty in my water pump because we need that beneficial bacteria. Like that is the key to keeping your fish tank alive and healthy. The beneficial bacteria. Okay, guys, I, I, I kid you not. It looks like the water is a little murky right now, but that's because I got a mixture of the um, old water and the new water up in there. But once everything settled, it looks amazing. The cloudiness you see now is due to the fresh start of a new tank, basically. Daddy. That was some work, guys. Hey, baby, 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 baby. I think what? I started at 5.55 and I think it's like what? What time is it right now? Eight o'clock. So better more of two hours in five minutes. But my project is now complete. <laughs>